hello welcome to microsoft excel made easy so on our screen here is a rough data or a raw data that shows you some of the sales of a particular farmer so sales of strawberry for a particular farmer for the different quarters in a year and you are asked to find the revenue total expenses per quarter as well as the profit or loss so definitely profits will be uh, a positive number and loss will be a negative number after probably you've subtracted your total expenses from your overall revenue so we are going to be starting from scratch as well as formatting this table accordingly so do well to support our channel by smashing the subscribe button also like and share this video so we hope to make everything excel very very easy this is not restricting excel to professionals only you as a farmer can definitely use microsoft excel a housewife can use microsoft excel definitely students can use microsoft excel in fact in one of the examination in ict or computer studies you cannot escape microsoft excel questions either in igcsc or a levels ict so excel is universal teachers need microsoft excel even if you're a priest <laughs> you need microsoft excel now we start by definitely trying to resize the content of this worksheet so i'm just going to double click here and i just resize it so this data is a little bit to the extreme so why don't we just delete these two first columns and um sorry we are supposed to delete actually so delete these first two columns and you have this like this so have more room for us then supposing we go ahead to make this let's just make this uh, let's merge and center then um let's just add should we add a dark background to it then um let's make the text white then let's build in it and increase the font a little so we're going to copy this format we are going to copy this with format painter and we're going to paste it across like this is that right so paste it across like this then paste it across like this so how easy can excel be so i think we're trying to build something here and we're already good with that so i'm going to make this bold then i'm going to let's see let's see all right so you can always actually be very very creative with this all right so just play around with this so strawberry sales so i'm going to double click this format printer to copy it across this is that right so my table or my set of data is coming alive little by little so i'm going to build this also then um let me just pick uh, something light okay then i'm gonna do this all right then i'm just gonna copy format painter do this do this all right so you can just quickly do this and we are good to go all right so where our answer is i'm going to make it this make it this bold it increase this to let's say 14 I'm going to copy from my printer paste it here 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 all right so all right so these are where our answers will be then our profit and loss okay so let me just format this quickly all right so this is actually like we're trying to prepare grants to go ahead with our calculation so this has to be dark since it's all right so i'm going to increase this then format printer so add it here add it here add it here okay so this is just like um, a very fast way of us doing this so how do you calculate the revenue you have the yield in kg and have the price so you just multiply this and this and it will give you your revenue so equal to this multiplied by 
this is okay i should get your answer so your revenue is four hundred six thousand on the answer should be naira so price in naira then you have this variable expenses then fixed expenses so total expenses will be additional variable plus fixed so equal to this all right plus this then you should be able to get your answer so if it doesn't fit you can just double click here to make it fit automatically then you can go ahead to calculate your profit and loss your profit and loss will be what your revenue subtracted your total expenses subtracted from your revenue so profit and loss equal to this minus this so equal to so the profit for this particular first quarter is 218,000. so if you are actually preparing any form of report if you are preparing any form of business proposal or what have you, you can definitely use excel to bring out a whole lot of metrics is that okay then this still the same thing that we did before now equal to this multiplied by this all right so equal to so i'm going to speed up this video now so that uh we are done with this and so we are here how easy can this be very very easy to achieve just know how to multiply how to subtract and you are good to go how to add so you notice we started off by what just bringing out this design then adding all these colors just to show us where our answers are adding all this color to show us where our profit and loss is so the last thing we're going to do is to bring all the different result for profit and loss in this section here so ideally i want to transfer the different results we got for profit and loss to this section so some people might want to start typing the results one at a time but it's very easy for you to achieve so equal to you make reference to the cell all right so hit enter equal to you make reference to the cell second quarter hit enter equal to you make reference to the cell third quarter then equal to you make reference to the cell so fourth quarter so how easy can this be it's very very easy so if you want to have more visual view of the data you can go ahead to represent this as a chart is all right so i'm just gonna select the whole of this all right so go to insert then click on charts then you can select this to see how the farmer fell within this period is all right so it's very very easy to represent so from here you can see that the highest profit was made in the fourth quarter followed by the second quarter then the third quarter then the first quarter how easy can this be so if this chart is looking small you can right click here then move this chart to a new worksheet so click new worksheet then you can rename the chart as what uh, profits and loss so profits and loss all right so hit ok and it should move this chart to a new worksheet entirely for you so you can go ahead to format this chart accordingly then you are good to go hope you got value in this video go ahead to support our channel by subscribing to this youtube channel also like and share this video we made a very simple video on how you can actually design a monthly budget for your family using microsoft excel go ahead to watch it on your screen right away excel made easy